Hello, my name is Camtasia Studio, and I error after you finish recording five minutes. Ah! So today's episode is all about Behold Utsuho! Like, get ready to behold some serious beholden. Oh no, Utsuho's evolving! Ding! Congratulations, your Utsuho now evolved into Utsuho! And if you're not done beholding yet, we've got to do this quickly. Behold further, Utsuho! Congratulations, Erika is totally screwed. Heck yeah, okay. So, we've beheld Utsuho. Don't worry, I didn't lose much recording, by the way. So now there's one other quick thing we need to do in Celadon before destroying Erika. And that is... Knowing everything! Uh... Look, it's Raisin 2, I believe, a Printworks character who just happens to be sort of named Raisin, sort of? That I don't really know anything about. I don't actually... Even no. Uh, from my previous recording, I can get rid of the surprise that I that she starts with metronome, ride, study, something, and something else, mostly metronome, and it's totally not Imomiji. And I also know that her Toho Dex is like way down here somewhere. Way down here somewhere. There we go. Raisin is not their true name, but in fact a given name by the Watasuki sisters. No one knows her real name as of yet. So yeah. That's something. Now, let's get to the point of the episode. Which would be totally trashing Erika, I suppose. Because you don't need Cut to get in her gym anymore. I'm not going to go freaking get Cut until I have Surf. And there's a reason for that. You have all these Cut trees around, but I think you can just totally get through by... You know, torching everything, burning everything to the ground, burn, ha ha ha. Okay. But you get the idea. Basically, uh, Yi Utsuho here totally destroys everything. I don't know why Daiyuse is a grass type, but there you go, who cares? As long as it destroys everything, I don't particularly mind. Let's also use wing attack to sort of conserve, sort of, flame through our ammo. Oh no, it's Iyuka. The umbrella is not enough. This is gonna be like super fast paced because I've already done this. And also, I totally have class in like um, 25 minutes, <laughs> so I'm I'm using my time wisely, and that is what you should p learn from this. This episode is all about using your time wisely by holding down the fast forward button so that you have more time to use, wise or not. So basically, this gym is entirely full of grass type Tohomon, which was not the case for earlier gyms, I don't think. At least as far as their old elements went. By the way, medicine is like the most annoying thing. Because she's everywhere in the wild and she poisons and paralyzes and also poisons from fun contact. But I think I'm growing tolerant of this medicine as long as I have a bunch of flamethrower to flamethrower it up, you know. Uto is going to be like a level a billion D thousand by the time this is over. And that's fine with me. Utsuho fans should be pleased as well. Utsuho is a pretty good character. She's not very smart, but she's pretty cool. And she's fun to play as in fighting games. So yeah. The power of the sun, and um, the power of walking into wells a lot. Man, if only the actual Game Boy games had a speed up feature like this, that would be unbelievable. It's like Dodu Tower at the press of a button. Ha! Huh, okay. Uh, <laughs> Keep going. Probably this way. I don't even really know where am I supposed to go. Oh, right here. That was an ad. Pleased to meet you, my hobby. Blah, 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 blah. My hobby is dying. Good, I can satisfy your request. Oh, splendid. Oh, hey, we don't like bug and fire type. Oh, too bad for you. Look, it's the Aki sisters in their regular-ish forms that we have just witnessed. Bloop blop, you are dead. Hello, lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant. Oh dear, I must have dozed off. Welcome, my name is Erica. I'm the leader of Celadon here. I'm the student of the other... Oh, I suppose we should give you the dignity of normal speed. Or is it more dignified for you to burn faster? A more quick and painless death, maybe. Not my problem. Bullying. 
Utsuno grew to level a billion thousand. Fire spin. Well, let's see. Is fire spin better than what I have? Not particularly. I think we should just lower this one by the sidelines. I don't know what voice that was. But I don't need to spin fire. I just need to blast fire in your face all up ends. Oh, look. It is Super Aki Sister. They're returning. I am totally afraid of your winking and your leaves falling and oh one of the Aki sisters is the goddess of like dead leaves or something so I suppose I'm making her work easier ah, I think it's Minoriko actually Minoriko you should better be appreciative of these nice wheat over there can you assist me in making a sandwich once this is over Whoops, looks like I've grained a new badge. <laughs> oh, I'm the weeder. That's like a terrible pun on winner. It doesn't even work. So please ignore that particular um, little thing. TM19 contains Gig Drain. Okay, that's probably great. Uh, we can learn Gig Drain out of the people I have? I don't even care much. Actually, I do. Let's totally care, just to extend this extension a little bit more extendal-like. Oh, of course, Telly's able to learn it. That makes sense. I'm a rabbit, I'm draining your energies. <laughs> full of women. Well, yeah, that's kind of what happens in Tohomon. But... Uh, I wonder if he's talking about the trainers or even the Tohomo. Ah, how creepy is this old man? Vote now. On a scale of 1 to 10. Okay. Well, that was uh, Erica's gem. It's totally not going to be the whole episode, but it is going to be the first half of the episode. So, um, uh, see you after a break. A break which will be quite long for me because I have to go to class. <laughs> this was not the most planned plan, but it is a plan that I hope you will like. Huzzah! Alrighty, it's time for the other half of this video. Engage Operation Book Learnings. You will see what Operation Book Learnings entails momentarily. Let's see. Key items, items, lucky egg, yes. We will briefly sacrifice some attack power in order to get more EXP or the ants. Run this way! Ah! Oh, high medicine. Uh, you can die. Just, just throw that out there. Uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Team Rocket, are you guarding this house? No, you are not. Hello, Psychic TM and key items. TM case. Psychic, yes. But surely you normally don't learn Psychic until level 52 or so. So. Let's paste a machine on Patchouli's face, and Psychic is ours. Now, Patchouli, armed with power and luckiness, will go w wipe up things for EXP. And mostly we will be using Patchouli for this, entirely. Hopefully. So, hey, Casino, hey. This poster is totally not a secret. Patchouli. Time for you to get your- oh, right, dark types. Um, get your book learnings, Team Rocket. You gotta learn that being a bad guy is a bad thing. So let's go mop your face up with some cleanings. Once Patchouli gets all the experience, all of it, we might even get Patchouli to evolve again, and... Then we can use her supreme psychic abilities to go kill Koga's face off. And with Koga's face successfully removed, then we should be able to surf. And once we can surf, then I can do what I most desire. And then we can progress and do the things we're missing because of my stubbornness. So, that works out well, don't you think? Ah, okay, let's go. We can also go ahead and steal the self-scope back. Y just cause, you know, 
we can then do the tower and get more experience that way. And it would be pretty great if that happens. And it's going to. It's happening right now. We're just gonna go ahead and pretend that Bashir Lay is the only one in our party right now. He's giving Team Rocket one heck of a book learning. Get your experience. Ah, yes. The movement puzzles. Let's see where we end up on the crazy machines. Oh, there's a moonstone. Uh, and here we have uh, X speed, which is terrible because that is a terrible type of item. Now we have a DM12 that contains taunt. This game is laughing at me. Okay, what else is there? Uh, these puzzles break my brain sometimes. It's an unfortunate truth. Um, let's go here. Then we can do... Like, uh... We can... Uh, be like, we... Then we can... Actually... Let's see. One super potion. Hee <laughs> hee, I got it. Now, where are we actually trying to get to in this? Again? Anywhere in particular? I mean, I, I don't really know. Well, I guess I accidentally sent myself back to the beginning of it. Alright, oh, we're supposed to go down. Got it. can go like whoop, whoop. hello down now we can go up here and there's some rockets to eat I mean launch into blasting off again yes yes all that stuff for those interested I believe patchouli evolved into e patchouli at level 38 yes there's a tohodex included in a little text file that goes along with this and that's kind of convenient. And so, I know when things happen. I try not to spoil myself too much, though. I just look at the ones that I have already to see what I can learn. Oh yeah, I'm just kind of blasting things with a bubble indiscriminately. Even though Haha Air Cutter is terrible because Pacholi doesn't have any attack power. But I'm just kind of blasting things indiscriminately with Bubble Beam without realizing that the Chen's we're weak to it. Hyper Potion. It's a telephone. Better not use it. Wow, I didn't know you could inspect those. <laughs> Lights in different colors. Lights in different colors. Lights in different colors. Lights in different colors. Yeah, yes, yes. Right. Why can't I use the telephone? <laughs> it needs a key. An elevator key. Take the elevator to see my boss. Skills, 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 scoffs. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm guessing the elevator key is dropped by some dude who's like, I'm not gonna drop the elevator key, what you talking about? Uh... Or we could just keep going down because that was a waste of time. Uh, haha. We got one from upstairs. Diggity what? Okay, that's cool. I'll humor you by lighting your face on fire. Oh, Momiji. You and your abused, angry eyebrows. The dark Pokemon are specifically listed as being abused. I believe. I mean, Tohoma. Razor Wind strikes the foe with a no longer two turn attack that doesn't quite suck as bad, but is still not that great. Oh, uh, yeah. Look at this machine be. Better not mess around with it. It probably extracts awesome from the surroundings because Team Rocket's a bunch of jerks. You found a rare candy. Gee, I wonder who we're gonna use that on after she levels. Uh. Operation Book Learnings. Woo. Okay, okay, let's, um, actually make try happen, and maybe that can mean we do something. Perhaps? Perhaps is false hope? I do not know. Woo, hello dude, stop meddling, or else I'll eat too much for cheesy. What's with me in eating as a verb? I don't quite know. It's kind of unsettling me. Oh no, it's dark patchy! Aww, she looks so... the same. She looks bored either way. Oh well. So, Patchy. Pacholi is now level 20... or 33. 32. 33. Now 33. 
wants to learn flamethrower. Well, gladly. Gladly, milady, you may learn the arts of fire. You found a blind flask. You are now cooler. You found a max other. You are now more max other having. Oh, there's the elevator key guy. I think, what was that? Baton pass? Did I see baton pass? Maybe I... That would be weird, because I don't think that was a... I guess that was a team at some point. Or maybe it's just a team now. I don't know. Who has the lift key? I wonder. And could it be... V with the key? Oh, hi, Dark Rigu. Wow, you really look like a Team Rocket there. Whoa! Barely survive him. No! Oh no, I dropped the lift key. <laughs> Into this convenient Pokeball, which you can pick up. Cough, a cough, a cough. Okay, that's great, guy. Hip Chula, eat a potion. That's good for you. I should probably go ahead and work my way back to the Healings for Patchouli so that she has all the PP she needs to blast a hole into the universe. Because through the universe anyways. We don't need no universe. We just need Patchouli. Patchouli is a pretty great character. Even when I'm not pronouncing her name in southern accents and blowing everything up with her. She's one of the more likable and more widely liked Toho characters apparently. Cause I'm like, hey everyone, what's your favorite Toho? And they're all like, Pacholi. Maybe she brainwashes people. I don't know. Let's see, where are we going exactly? Yes, we're going here, and then we're going here, and then we're going here, and okay, these puzzles aren't actually that bad at all. I almost did it wrong in my hastiness, but hey, I'm guessing going down is the answer. Yeah, probably. Uh, here is a Pokeball. You found a Calcium. That makes people have bones. Okay. Oh no, it's Riggle. Darn, Riggle. From beyond the moon. That is a total, like, Lance pose or something, honestly. Let's see. Okay, I do kind of wonder legitimately what Pokemon Tohovani will have. I suppose we'll have to wait and see. Hey, what's up? How can you not see the beauty of our evil? Because you're stupid and I hate your face. Goodbye. Oh no, it's Super Dark Shin. Who doesn't look that dark to me. She's just kind of angry. Whatever. Beggars can't be choosers and these people... Did he just say i i i i ah Was that in the original script? It's totally a Toho reference. Anyway, because everything's Toho reference. Hey, what's on your laptop? It looks like a report about a Toho with three forms. It's too difficult to understand, but it looks like... Uh, what the deuce is that? Um, Got a yin-yang, got a thing, and got another thing. A couple of shrine maidens, maybe? PC-98s? So I must say you are impressed. I mean, I am impressed that you are impressed. I mean, I am Giovanni. For your insolence, I am Giovanni. And there's Dark Chen, the darkness of Chen. Oh dear, you are fast. But Patchouli is better than you. DC Suica? Okay, Dark Suica equals Drunk Suica. How are you faster than me? You're drunk. Ah. Uh, plan is falling to peace. Grr. But how is, is Patchouli really that slow? Oh dear. Um. Well, I guess the answer to that is, unfortunately. Hello, Buster Sword. Do I have any revives, by the way? I do, in fact. Patchouli, come to life. And I will... Whoa, hang on there. Unzan, you will have to be a distraction. You were distracted. Good job. And you, you will die. You didn't die fast enough. I'm disappointed. Hey! Good! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Giovanni! I need to go eat a pie. I'm sorry, I failed you, Imbra. Okay, fine. Eh, uh, whatever. Oh, hello. Would you like to meet Telly? I think she would like to be racing for now. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, don't slap that mud at me. That's what you get. All of this is what you get. What the heck did I just... I... Whatever. You're dead. Uh-oh. That ruckus somehow opened the door. I like how they don't even know what they're only... What they're... Uh, you know what I mean. Or maybe you don't. I don't know. So, let's go save. Then we can do stuff. And we can win things. But first of pause because I'm pausing a lot. Because... Yes. Alrighty, it's time for the third half of this video. Let's keep going to the left. I mean right. This is definitely to the right. What am I talking about? Directions are difficult when you are not thinking. Ah. Uh, route 8, huh? I guess there's a route here. Kind of forgot about that. So we're on City to Lavender Town. Okay, then. Kind of forgot there was a thing here. But I guess that's okay in the end, because I can ignore basically everyone on this route. It, basically everyone. Oh look, it's Towie, but not the real one, as you know. Did you just describe Towie as round? I read the race and evolves when it's exposed to a moonstone. Welcome to Creepy Land, in the meantime. This town is known as the Gravesite of Towie. Everyone is dead. Uh, that's cool. Uh, by the way, I have like a bunch of great balls, I should mention that. Uh, let's buy some of these. And uh, let's buy some of these. You know, just in case. It's a legitimate concern. Hmm? Uh, I think that's enough. What ghosties await us in the ghosty place? Uh, let's also see who's died recently. Bless your Toho loving heart, son. I'm not a son, I'm a daughter. Aww. Why is Raisin so everywhere in this game? And Momiji. And, okay, so Momiji and Raisins are susceptible to death. Got it. Hey there. Hey, Sugar. Brings you here. Is your Toho dead? Hey, it's alive. I can at least make them faint. Let's go. So, as everybody knows, this guy, like... In the original, he totally had Eradicate before this, and he didn't have Eradicate during this battle, so it's implied that his Eradicate, like died, and he's actually here for legitimate purpose, but he sure doesn't- Whoa, Patchouli's trying to learn a freaking earthquake. Uh, <laughs> well, thank you very much. I'm sure that'll be useful even though Patchouli's attack power is rather good. So, the point is, this guy has something dead, and uh, I don't know what it is, because I haven't been paying attention to his types. But I, well, I mean, you know. Hey, 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 get your Patchouli off my Patchouli. You stinker! I took it easy on you, too! Okay, so Yomu is Cubone, and Yuki is Marowak. Good to know. Um... I was going to ask, who's gonna be the Mama Marowak? But I guess we answered that question just now. Even though I already have a Yuki that's in my PC that I didn't really say much about yet. So let's go. Let's go fight possessed people. In Fog Town. Be gone, beloved little spirit. Ah, uh, look, it's Lyrica. Oh, yeah. The prison rivers are gonna be hanging around here. Kikwa. Kikwa, kikwa. I'm a possessed guy. I've got possessed pants. Check out my possessed pants dance. Sorry, I was possessed. Use that excuse for everything, I bet. Oh, hey, Lunasa. You are... Lunasa, you're probably my favorite Prison River sister? I don't know, because you're more serious business than the rest of you. Also because I play viola. But, hey. Um, I don't know if we have anything well-equipped for catching. Let's use the Hulk, who is totally the strongest. And by that, I mean weakest. So, now we can assist. Huzzah! Lunasa, let's go. Ghostly violinist. Pessimistic, me, melancholic. Well, that's... Some word combos you got to go in there. Uh, you know what? I'm going to write my own Toho fanfiction in which you are a viola player instead of a violinist. Because I like that better. And therefore you're Alto Clef. Okay. I think you need to learn communication skills. Sir or madam. 
you found an escape room. I forgot that those worked in this tower, even though I don't think you need one. It's Merlin! Merlin, the trumpet player of the wavy type. Now now, Cerno. Don't kill- Oh, Cerno! You killed it! What do you have to say for yourself? Be cursed! Being cursed just makes you yell funny words, I guess. So perhaps I am cursed all the time. <laughs> well, hoo hoo to you too. Hoo hoo hoo. Hoo hoo You found an elixir. So do ghost Pokemon count as dead or not? Eternal debate. Prison rivers are not technically alive because they are, you know, like manifestations of desire or something or other. I don't even know. I forget what the poltergeists is what they call them, I believe. I don't know why I'm burning everything. It's probably because burning everything is fun. I must have been dreaming. Nothing up there. Hello, healing circle. You shall join us. What am I going to join you in? Am I going to join you in a concert? Or, like, flower viewing or something? That would be nice. Ah. Give me your ball. Oh, hi, Lyrica. When you evolve, you play the keyboard with one hand. That's good enough. Hey, look, it's Channeler Tammy. That's kind of funny to me, specifically. Well, Pachoa is evolving. I've had enough book learnings to so I learn how to change my shape into a better one. Behold the power of knowledge. And thus, Patchouli did evolve into E. Patchouli, equipped with a chair and many books. She took her hat off, though. Oh well. We found the Clint's dead. Regardless, zombies! Ah, we will keep leveling Super Patchouli, for she is a sent. Wait. Level 36? Wasn't I just level 38? Hold it. Hmm. I think this programmer dude, what, screwed up some of the things where... As I believe Ron explained the possibility to me, or someone did, that... Well, they changed the Pokémon's e-experience curve between their evolutions, as in there are some, there are like different leveling speeds, like slow, fast, all around, quick, wacky, you know, that sort of thing. So they must have different ones between evolutions in some cases, such as this case, where E-Patchouli takes more experience to level than regular type Patchouli. And in one case, I had something jump two levels after I evolved it, which would be... Uh, 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 I forget, but there might be someone in my party right now. Let's see if I can spark a memory here. It might have been Cerno. I don't think it was Cerno. No, it wasn't. Key, 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 key. That's cool. May you burn in purgatory. Okay. Now that we're level 37 again. Oof, qua. Oh, hey, it's Yuyuko! I like Yuyuko. Well, can we find a Yuyuko somewhere? Something fell- did you just say something fell out? With that surprised expression? That- uh, uh, I, I don't know what to take from that. Can we find Yuyuko in this tower? That'd be pretty cool. I like Yuyuko. She's one of my favorites. Um... We can get Merlin. Poltergeist, the Princess Trumpeter. Massive- manically obsessive over things she's interested in. And also known to glitch out and keep attacking you, so sometimes portrayed as slightly crazy. Let's just name her after her biggest detriment to fighting. She, she is wavy. That's probably, you know, not very inspired, but who cares. Hey, Patchouli, do you like candy? Oh yes, I like candy. That's great, because I'm talking to myself with your voice. That's kind of creepy. Okay. So, like, hello, totally Marowak. Oh, that's e Yugi. He looks kind of creepy. He looks kind of wooden, like Geno. Let's tie this into other things. I forget what type you count as. Probably steel. Yep. This was the restless spirit of Yomu's father. 
farther. Did I just say farther? I meant farther. What's up? I'm Team Rocket. All of it. Who are you using? Oh look, it's more of Amelia's. I get it, because they're like bats. And I used to use the bats all over the place. So let's just torch some people. I'm running out of torching people button, which is unfortunate. Um, I guess we'll just have blast their minds open again instead. Tohos are only good for making money. That's ironic because the Toho games are free. Well, I think they started out being free. Well, I don't know. You might have sold them from the beginning, but they were totally free if um if you um um let's pretend I didn't say that. Yep. Uh, got it. Burn in water. Doesn't really work. Don't fight us rockets. Hey, you came to save me? Thank you about that. Came here of a doo ba doo ba doo 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 doo. Oh, hi. Komachi is tired. Toho are nice to hug. Oh, Hug that Komachi. That's kind of adorable. Also, you can interpret that in... Well, in silly ways, due to certain aspects of Komachi, which have been, um, uh, embraced by the fandom? Oh no, the R, the M is missing for your name, Arfuji. The Toho Dex quest is one that requires strong dedication. Without deep love for Toho, your quest may fail. I'm not sure if this will help you, but here have a flute that you can use to awaken a giant turtle who is not actually in your way. Monthly grand prize. Oh, I cannot apply for the Toho grand prize. That's a shame. But what we can do is end this friggin' episode on a healed note. So, with Pacholi totally in shape for demolishing the universe. Dang, that's a lot of attack. Like, dang. Let's compare that special attack to everyone else's special attack. Like, dang, yo. Dang. Dang is what I'm getting at here. Let's go ahead and look at E. Patchouli's Pokédex entry, or Toho Dex. If we can find her. I'm assuming the E's will be down here somewhere. Is racing. This. Looking for psychic types, too. Racing to Yorihime. Where is E. Pachioli? Maybe she is up here with the regular Pachiolis on like what? Well, yeah, that would make sense because she's technically Alakazam. Derp. Oh, right, where is she? Where you at? Let's look at all the Pachiolis. As she suffers from asthma and her body is weak, she uses magic to support herself when she goes outside. A magician with an expansive amount of knowledge manipulates the elements from the seven days of the week. Hey, wait a minute. You know, these weight amounts are actually fairly reasonable for patchouli. Except it now gives me the image of patchouli only being four feet tall. Except that is pretty amazingly adorable, and I am now going to accept it as canon. Anyway, this has been Shag, and it is time for us to go. I believe next time is more Mario RPG again. So, see you then.